Hi everybody, Carol here. Welcome back to my channel. So I am set up differently as you can see because I have decided to finally take the plunge and do a spinning kind of a pour with a turntable. So I've got some paper towels blocking me and I'm working on the other side of the table. Let me tell you the paints. That is Payne's Gray. Then we've got the white, which is the Saks True Flow Heavy Body, mixed with some Deco Art Satin Enamel White. There's 24 karat gold from Deco Art. And then this is also Deco Art Extreme Sheen Pink Tourmaline and Color Shift Pink Flash. This is just a little bit of Prussian blue with a lot of white, which is mostly Deco Art Satin Enamel White. And that is just Prussian blue. And then I will repeat things. Sometimes my head gets in the way, so I'm gonna move quickly there because you would see nothing but the back of my head. But I really just repeated everything once more, putting white in the middle in a spot or two. And then that's it. I don't even fill the cup all the way up. I just finish it off with a drop of Payne's Gray as you will see after I put in this last of the Prussian blue. And then I decided, I'm just gonna do a straight pour and spin it and see what happens. And take my chances here. So here we go. This is all in regular speed until we finally get to the spinning, I put it up to two times because it's very slow. Okay, so then once I'm done doing this, I will do a quick torch, and then you'll find me tilting it somewhat so that we can get it more in the center before I start spinning. Then after it's centered, I start spinning, and it's really funny here, you'll see, before I started speeding it up to two times speed, I think, I got it down pat. This spinning thing is easy. And then you'll see what happens when you don't have it completely centered on your turntable. So here we go. Oh, look, this is easy. Ah, oh, piece of cake, no problem. Easy. Weave. Whoops. Guess not that easy. <laughs> so then I made sure after that, I kept checking, making sure I was centered <laughs> all the time. <laughs> so now we're at two times speed, believe it or not. That's how slow I was turning it because I was a chicken and I really didn't want paint to splash everywhere. And I didn't know if the speed would just mess things up. So I just kept changing direction. And little by little, it inched to the edges and went over and stayed pretty uniform. I had to sometimes tilt it a little bit to adjust where things were, but for the most part, it really spread out very evenly. I was real pleased with it. I'm definitely going to do more spinning. 
In the meantime, I am working on that other painting that I'm doing embellishment on, but that's taking time because it's going to be several stages with drying and resin. So that video won't be up for a while. I think what I'm going to do is try this again and set myself up maybe a little differently so my head doesn't keep getting in the way. I apologize about that. I definitely need a haircut, <laughs> but the salon is closed right now. Finally, it gets so far to the edges. There's just a little bit, little bit left to cover on some of the edges. So I finally just stopped and uh, used my finger to help the paint along. My medium, as usual, two parts Elmer's glue all, one part water, and then I mix it one to one with my paints. My paints are fairly thick. You could stand a stick up in them. Now you see I'm just touching up the little areas that didn't get covered. A little bit of tipping just for composition's sake. I really didn't do a lot of movement, just a little. I love the way it's coming out. Here we go, now I'm just doing a last torch. Very much looks like water to me, like a, a tidal pool or something like that. So now we're gonna go down. You'll see the close-ups. And let me just say, if you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, Check out the description below for info on how to join my Instagram, Facebook, visit my shop, or contact me. And all the paid information is there also. So that's it. Stay safe. See you soon. And have a great day.